Hello everyone, in this video tutorial you will learn how to record a desktop on your Raspberry Pi. We will be using a simple program called Kazam or Kazam. I created this video tutorial since I was really surprised by the fact that we can actually record our screens on Raspberry Pi and this is very useful for creating video tutorials or documenting your work such that later on you can remind yourself of, for example, a series of commands that you typed in your terminal. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Let's start. As I mentioned at the beginning of this video, we'll be using this program called Kazan. However, it's a good idea to explain you how to install this program. Consequently, open a terminal. And you need to execute two commands before you can actually install this program. You need to type sudo apt get update and after that you need to type sudo apt get upgrade. Click on yes And now you'll see that your basically operating system is being upgraded. After sudo apt get upgrade, we need to type the following command that will actually install Kazam. Okay, in my case, you can see that I already have Kazam. However, in your case, you will see an installation progress window over here. Okay. So once you install Kazam, you need to start it. Let's start Kazam. We click over here, then under this option, sound and video, we will find our program. Here you can adjust if you want to record mouse cursor and if you want to record sound from microphone. In my case, I have a microphone that's basically a USB microphone and I'm recording right now my voice by using this microphone. The main options are over here under File and Preferences. If you open this window, under Screencast, you can adjust the frame rate. In my case, I'm using 30 frames per second. However, if you have a slower processor, you can decrease this number. And over here, it's very important to choose the proper option. I'm recording an MP4 file. However, you can also record other files. I didn't test different options, however, I know that this option is actually working. And over here you can record the screenshots and that's basically it. Close this window and to stop recording, you will click over here and you will click on finish recording. And right now I will finish this recording. 